Hi, I'm Kyrie, yeah. and this week we went to the Reptile Zoo in Fountain Valley, California. I didn't know it at the time, but this is actually the home base of Jay's Historic Pets. He's got about 2.2 million subscribers, just a little more than us. If you haven't seen him before, he's a fun mix of a jolly uncle and a crazy person. And because of that, it was just really cool to see his place in person. But that definitely wasn't our first impression. I thought we had the wrong address. We turned into a random strip mall and I uh, looked at Trang and was like, nah. Uh, but she insisted. She said that all of our friends that have gone before us really love the place, so uh, we decided to check it out. And while I was hesitant at first, my interest peaked as soon as we got in through the doors. You walk into what appears to be just a regular reptile zoo, but you soon realize it's been transformed into something completely unique, so you just need to throw out any of your existing expectations. To the right, there's a giant pond full of turtles and fish. Uh, next to that is a giant pen of tortoises, just ready to eat the food you buy them. Uh, to the left is the entrance to the zoo. Once you get in, you're bombarded by one beautiful reptile after another. We were just completely blown away. Uh, from chameleons to alligators, the reptiles do seem to have it all. We saw reptiles we didn't even know existed, let alone the sheer size of some of the creatures in there. Uh, the snakes were easily the biggest I'd ever seen in my life, so, uh, so we kept our distance and let them do their work. Our girls really loved the zoo. Our youngest, Emery, seemed to have the best time ever. Running from one display to another, she was just pointing out every single animal. With all of the adventuring we've been doing the past year, I'm pretty sure this is the most she's ever been entertained. Our oldest daughter was so curious about everything going on, she managed to capture one of the employees who happily answered all of her questions. So yeah, when you roll up to the reptile zoo, don't judge a book by its cover. It's an amazingly fun place to bring the kids and we'd recommend going. That's it for us in the reptile zoo. Please share this video with any of your friends and families you think might want to visit. It would really help us out a lot. So we'll see you next week. That's it for this week. Make sure to hit that subscribe button. Did you like the reptile zoo? Yep. What do you like most about it? Um, um, turtle. What else did you like? Fish. Oh.